Ahoy there, and welcome back to the Adventures of Captain Gujon, Volume Two. Just checking out my fish and duck best friends because they're both aquatic, I imagine. Oh, they're not racist, but it's really irrelevant. So today, I think I'm going to try and max out the captain's mechanical building oh, ability well. and try and make some kind of sex robot. High hopes. They'll probably be dashed. Oh man, this guy's a, he's such a hobo. This is the point. Before you eat anything, you're gonna do your fucking chores. You hear me? That's right, pick that fucking ocean up. And put it directly back on the floor. Fantastic. Good job. Good job. Look how adorable he is while he sleeps. No one would have known that he's a terrible, terrible bastard. That likes stealing from the poor and giving to his own pocket. My god, that toilet really does need a clean. Jesus Christ. Ooh, it's got lovely floral patterns on the top. See, I need to make some more money today, because I want to go on holiday. To Egypt. Since pirates like sand? Yeah, we'll go with that. I'm intrigued to what this skill is that he's gaining. Or is this a process? No, it's a process. I was going to say, is that like the domestic woman skill? A lifelong ambition to become a housewife? If I see one more pile of fucking clothing, I'm going to burn the house to the ground. I will. I'll do it. I will murder you. I will murder you! Ah, uh, it runs with my old job. Nice. That looks fucking terrible. It has high res textures. That. That salmon and onion. That's like the worst combination ever. My god, that hot. God, that hot quick. Mm. You feel the smell of your own farts, don't you? Stir that shit. That's right. Mmm. Mmm. I had broccoli yesterday. Mm. Oh, he's also a magician as well as a cook. Good news. Come on. Oh, no. Olivia Newt John's oh, dead. Zawangwa. We killed her. Why would I do that? Oh, I don't really give a shit, really. You're not the kind of person who would like to pose. Do you live here? Excuse me, Mexican person. Oh, okay. That's weird. You. Limzer, Masto. You're a, I'm gonna. You have a terrible home. I can't believe she's gone. She's all your fault, Duck. You're supposed to be watching her. Bastard. Friend. I love fishing. You caught a big one. Oh no. It's dead. Right. What did I say? What did I say about those goddamn fucking clothes? That's it. Yeah, let's just make some some casual waffles. You want if you can't have nice you can't have nice things. Obviously. So you know what? We're not gonna have any nice things. Oh, a job. Three minor nah, I'm good. I can just steal those things. Why would I make them? I have to do stuff. That's right. Little did he know that the pancakes would actually be his downfall. Uh -oh. It's growing more and more out of control. These things happen. Waffles kill. Just so you know, waffles kill. Well, I think we all learned something there. That money can do anything. And also, wash your goddamn clothes, otherwise I'll burn your fucking house down. Gay? Go gay. <laughs> Possibly the weirdest thing ever happened on Sims. What is it with my house and zombies hanging out underneath it? Seriously, do you not have like a care home to go to or something? Ugh. You're real pretty. 
Probably my girlfriend. No, you can't because you don't have any. Ooh. Wow. You you keep doing that. You please carry on. Sea sludge? <laughs> that sounds cute. Let's put that in there. Denise is not an appropriate name for si for, for sludge, really. Um, what else is slimy and black and greasy? Um, Starbucks. Perfect. That makes a lot of. S My God. Oh, well. Still invisible. Uh oh. Pay the bills. Pay the bills. Don't want the man with the blowjob machine to come round. I try to remain as fashion conscious as I can, but these chest of drawers were just something else. Look at the craftsmanship. There's butterflies. I feel like I'm there. Oh my god, a raccoon. Goddamn raccoons. Can I have a raccoon as a pet? That'd be pretty awesome. Hey. I'm not sure petting a raccoon's a good idea. So, Captain, you know why we're here. Because you look like a royal prick. Let's find something more piratey. Because you look like a right twat. Um, I want something nautical. Because at the moment, you look a bit like Kenneth Branagh. He is a number one D bag. Right. That's quite piratey. And it's fairly, uh, fairly chic. If that's the word. Okay. We all know that pirates love the colour. No, that's a bit, a bit mince. Brown. Oh, it's a lovely tan. I like that. And where should we go? Oh, we need like an off-white, I think. Because you know, um, pirates didn't have Daz back in the day. They had scurvy. And I think a darker brown would look. Oh, we just look absolutely gorgeous. And let's go for a red waistcoat. That seems like a legit. Nice. No pirates complete without his terrifying face mask. Turn to those romantic evenings with your big girlfriend. So Javad will not spend any time with me. So I'm going to go over there. And make him spend fucking time with me. Because if my plan is to work, then we need to, we have to be friends. He's going to be my friend. Whether he fucking likes it or not. He's cheating on me again. Bilbo. With another gay space captain. Pay attention to me. Hey. Hey. There we go. Let me in. Apologize. I'm really sorry for being a murderer. For being horrible. To you. What? But you know what I won't apologize for? Is your goddamn dress sense. Let's show him a gross video. Check this out. Kim Kardashian sex tape. Gross. Uh oh. Oh, thank God. I thought I was going to kiss him. Oh, oh, caruggle. Wow, that was mean. You're definitely going to die now. I just assumed you were gay. The outfit sends off different vibes. Who's this? Who are you? Fuck off. Crump in my style. Right, Barry. Business time. I've done the seven seas. I've killed whales with my bare hands. I can take you. Alright, pussy. So after the captain's been doing so well with all of his evil deeds, I decided to treat him to a lovely Mac. Look at that. You can almost see the speed that I've even been turned on. I've also got my desk and decorate it with his favourite things. I've got the uh, lettuce seed, just in case you... Uh, just in case. Uh, very pretty pink flowers to remember that, you know, life could be worse. Yep. Got his digital camera for his dick pics on the internet. Standard. And the duck, since the duck did fuck all use looking after Olivia Newt John. So we finally got Javed to come around after him in such a goddamn tease, and we're going to make him some delicious mac and cheese. 
But my god, he'll never forget this mac and cheese. So the key to making perfect mac and cheese is to make it in two separate rooms and for one person to start it and the other person to finish it. <laughs> doop, 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 doop. There we go. And also the, the other way of making good mac and cheese is to make sure there are plenty of chairs to sit on if you get tired while making it. I'm sure everyone knows this though. We're just insulting a few people, but yeah. So I like to make sure my guest has plenty of seats to choose from. Good. Perfect. And now the key is to wait two to three in game hours for it to cook perfectly. And there we have it the perfect mac and cheese. Now, the smoke Ooh, inhalation is a big part of the delicious meal. Huh? You want to make sure that you have plenty of it before the fire catches onto your clothing. And with his latex douchebag clothing, like we always probably Let talked about, it's going to be okay. Oh no! No, Javed, no! You are on fire! This is not something I intended to do. Javed finally kicked the bucket. After a solid ten hours of being on fire, the lesson is learned from this. Oh, there he is. And a reaper. Have your way with him. In a sexy way. Took a lot of killing, I'm not gonna lie. I'm quite surprised by how much death. What the fuck? Oh, it's okay, he's a ghost. A fire ghost? Sweet. Ugh. Dog! Samo! Yeah, Oscar. I know, right, death. There are chairs everywhere. I just don't know why. It's my chair museum. Chair and fire museum. Ah, that worked out. Just right. Personally, I'd say it's quite tasteful. It commemorates him as he lived. Ooh, the paper's here. Just gonna. Just need to make sure that we fully respect it, since this is also something which he would have wanted. Beautiful. I think I've just had an amazing idea. Since I have a houseboat, what else do pirates love but the seven seas? A desert island, right? You see where I'm going with this? Well, I've just told you where I'm going with this, so of course you know where I'm going with this. But yeah, it's going to be fucking rad. Palm tree. Amazing. Oh my god. Another brainwave. You know what? I think that's it. It's just perfect. It summarizes everything. Especially his cunty clothing. Perfect. Lonely. Quickly, the mac and cheese. I know it's your fucking birthday, but the mac and cheese is burning. Look what happened last time. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, my game's lagging as well. Come on. Seriously, Ooh, mac and cheese, you right in front of you, burning. <laughs> get it done. Oh, oh no, get out. Oh, you absolute twat. Oh. Oh. Fantastic, there's a fire. Literally right there. Good happy birthday, you bellend. Put out the fire. Oh, oh stop, Ada! Literally, brand new cooker, honestly. So we're coming to the end of Captain Goujon's super fun time adventure day. And it's been a good one. It's been a good one, but there's one thing we need to do. We need to go see that douchebag Barry that we had a fight with, because he's an absolute arse bandit. And he's not in. 
Hmm. Hmm. I think it's upset that I killed his friend, but I don't really give two shits. But we can wait. We're here. And there's Barry. You. You wanna talk shit to me, Barry? Do you? It's the end, my friend. I don't follow no rules, Barry. This is just how it is. You don't fucking talk to me like that, Barry. It's right, bitch. You take it. Oh, what's that, Mum? See you die. What happens when you fuck with the Goujon? What? What, setting that to pieces well? Yeah? One piece of this? Well, <laughs> it's been interesting. Thank you for watching the video. If you like this shit, like this shit. If you want to subscribe, feel free. Don't be afraid to share. Uh, and until next time, when I can probably kill the rest of this city with my one punch kills, Captain Gujon, out. Well, heave him up and away you will go. We're all bound over the mountain.